Hello everyone and welcome. My name is Tasi and I'm a founder of Dataverse Analytics, YouTube channel made for anyone who want to make sense of data, solving real world problem and learn how to use software to get real insight. So are you tired for boring lecturers? Do you want to actually use tools like Python, Power BI or SPSS for real life and even add tricks for making and that problem into simple by solving it according to the real world pro uh, projection or speed of real world. So are you inspired with data in everyday life that you made so that you can make your life easier? This is the hub for you so that you can increase uh, your skills in data by looking into the real world problem by using those softwares to solve it. Here is the three areas that Dataverse Analytics we are going to focus on. We first start by statistics made simple, uh, software and hands-on tutorial, programming for research and business, research, business and technology. Uh, whether you are beginner or advanced learner, we help you to build your skills and confidence. And even after completing each course, I'm sure that you will know how to build your portfolio by foreshowing the current what you already gain from that. This is our uniqueness that we have as our data verse analytics, as I said. And this is the curriculum the, that we are going to focus on. And at first, we focus on the foundation. Uh, we started by the statistics, what is statistics, why data matter today, and also we look at the introduction to the Python, R, Stata, SPSS, Power BI, Google Workspace, Tableau, SQL, and also Artrex design. This is Artrex. It's a new thing that is coming in our technologies today because we can use Artrex by using it, by solving, like even you can do prediction, but mostly with no code. It's just drag and drop. It's mainly focused as it has any... Uh, uh, the picture, like I said, you may do like a prediction without learning a code like as we do in Python or in Stata or other programming. Just you can click and drag by using ad tricks to make even machine learning, something like that. You know that it's somehow important. And session two, we really focus on software tools and data analytics. Uh, session three, we focus on programming for data science. And also session four is for advanced statistical model. And also session five, academic writing and professional skills. And at the session six, we will focus on real world project by using that software. And this is uh, the comparison of the tools that we are going to run in Dataverse Analytics Hub. Uh, the first, when we say SPSS, uh, mostly it's best for social science and health research. And the uniqueness of SPSS is like simple in interface and the grid for beginner. So you can use SPSS by click and drag. Uh, and also you can use uh, Stata uh, for econometric model and academic research mainly for those who are in the field of economics uh, you you know what we call uh, fixed or panel model uh, to use data is somehow better compared to the other softwares and it's strong in the panel and time series analysis as i said and also excel it's easier for the beginner for basic analysis and the calculations like mostly the report that we we do like data um, uh, descriptive analysis that we can made like a report which is going to publish for anyone who are not uh, specifically in this field of statistics we can use excel for doing basic analysis like um, plotting a graph and widely use flexible for quick report uh, as i said if you want to generate a quick report you can use excel and even you can do like simple or dashboard or beginner dashboard but without having like into a dynamic dashboard but you can do simple by using excel and even you can use power bi uh, we will run power bi by 
business dashboard and reporting and it has it has it has like interactive dashboard or interactive visualization and automation and also for google sheet we look at the collaboration in real time uh, you can use Google Sheet to co make collaboration. Suppose I have a project that I'm working with and also have my friend from uh, another continent. So we need to share like the Google Sheet that can help us to uh, do the same work but sh without having like same office. Yeah, this is how Google Sheet will help us. And it's free and it's cloud-based and work with Google tools. If I say cloud-based, you, you can... Uh, get uh, your stuff wherever time whenever you are you can access it just it's required to be online you can access it anywhere and also a uh, SQL SQL uh, structure query language we will use uh, we will look at data extraction and management uh, idea for big data big database to store data or queries if you want to to manage a big data or a lot of data, we we'll use SQL to store, to store that information. Yeah. And also you will continue to uh, focus on Python and other programming uh, for data science and machine learning, especially for data we look at uh, data science and Python, sorry, for data science and machine learning. It's mostly powerful for coding and automation. And other programming, we look at advanced statistics and modeling. Uh, it's perfect for visualization or explanatory data analysis. It's better to use other programming. And also Tableau, visual storytelling for with data. If you want to, be, to become like a storyteller in Story data in data, we can use Tableau. Uh, we can also use Tableau by drag and drop, dashboard, easy sharing. You can also publish. And also someone can see your dashboard that you made like publicly. Uh, Tableau also has that uniqueness. Aritrex, it's like workflow automation. It can do extract, transform, and load. Yeah. And then it's no code data branding and advanced analysis, as I said. And also, why so many tools? Each tool has its strength. Think of them like toolbox. You pick the light one depending on your job. What to clean? Messy data first. Try Atrex. Want to clean? messy data fast try atrex this is important thing when you need like to make data cleaning in simple and uh, simple and fast i recommend you to use atrex because it used to clean data faster and easy easiest way and then you can also want to show the trend with chat maybe by using tableau or power bi and need to analyze healthcare data, you can use SPSS or ARA, it's a grid, and need to write code for machine learning model, use Python, and also want to make automated report in cloud, try the Google Sheet plus Roca Studio, um, and also we will focus on programming and real world skills. On this channel, we also cover Python for data science and machine learning, other for statistics and visualization, SQL for data management, AI and predict predictive model, econometric model like panel, time series, and Hausmann test. Everything we teach is hands on using real example for business, healthcare, finance, and, and more. And we at the end we will do like project real world case study. We will take like the project, especially we will use the data available for the cargo community so that we can do or be we, we prefer to use cargo because it's free, everyone can access the data and then you can use it either by doing a practice. This data it can show us the real uh life 
uh, experience by based on that the dummy data and even we will do we will see how we can do dummy data if i say dummy data it means to create our own data based on our understanding by using programming language especially for python and other programming we will see how we can do dummy coding and even ai you you know there is a lot of ai that can help us to make dummy coding for example i may say that i want to learn i want to analyze the, the case scenario or any field of health but i don't have data so that i can model that problem i can use ai or machine learning or i can use python or other programming so that i can generate my own data based on the variable of interest that i want to focus on this is where we will use uh, those real world sense studies uh, by also use the data from open source or also we can create our own data based on our understanding uh, we will use real world case study as i said the project like sales prediction health data analysis customer segmentation and also we will focus on academic writing and how to select a light model for your thesis uh, and one of the things that I can say, why do you really need to make subscribe? Whatever you are student, professional or researcher, we made the data easy, practical and powerful. So subscribe for step-by-step -step tutorial, easy to understand explanation and career team, live session and expert interview, uh, we will have that part in our hub or in our YouTube channel. So let's run together. So don't forget to make subscribe, hit and build and comment what you want to run next. If you see that things is interesting, just share to your friend. And also if you see that there is a missing, just type on comment and then inform us so that we can make a good thing. Uh, we are here to run and together we will turn data into insight and idea into innovation and thank you and welcome to the dataverse uh, analytics as i said there is always room for improvement i'm here as a, a teacher but also you can teach me how i can improve my things that i deliver to the real world person so thank you for watching